Now we're gonna go over how to replace a spark plug. Now that's not the most basic or easy troubleshooting part, but it's much more simple than one would expect. Now, the way you're gonna do it is pretty simple. We need to remove this plastic cover right here. Obviously, the generator needs to be off. Remove this plastic cover right here. And then we have the connection between the ignition coil and the spark plug. So now we're gonna remove it. It's very important not to do it when the just after you've run the engine because it's gonna be warm. So you don't wanna touch it. Um, so wait for at least 30 minutes, 45 minutes after you haven't been using it and then you can use it. Uh, then you can uh, come right here and replace the spark plug if, if need be. So we've taken the ignition coil away. Now you can see the spark plug. Now we need to remove the spark plug. We take this part that came with the generator and we place it here and then we need to turn it to open. So to turn it there's two holes right here. Just put this inside the screwdriver and you turn it a little bit and then pull a little bit tight and then you're able to remove it. So you unscrew the spark plug. So we got it right here. So now I take the faulty spark plug, put it back in its place, take a new one, which we can obviously provide you with, and put it back in. So that's just the opposite way. Now we're screwing it back in. It's very important to make sure to screw it in all the way so it fits really tight. So just when we get to the point where you cannot long, when you can no longer do it with your fingers, that's when you take the screwdriver again to tighten it just a little bit more. So now we finished putting the spark plug back in. I'm gonna put the cover right on top of it. Push it real hard so you make sure it fits real well. Put this cover, the plastic cover, and you're basically ready to run. I'll show you that it runs. For safety, once again, it's very important nothing's connected to any of the outlets when you start. Well, the earth is the only thing that's connected. Now we're gonna make sure again Fuel's on on, the valve's on, and the choke's on. Now we're gonna pull it, and as always, it's gonna start on the first pull. So thank you very much for watching this clip today. If you need any more information, you can go on the live chat on generatorpro.co.uk. You're gonna see the link right in the bottom of the screen right here.